Mexican people, welcome. So in today's video, we're gonna talk about falling in love with natural hair, especially in the type four spectrum, since that's where I live. Lately, there's been a fair amount of chat about not loving hair texture, either by celebrities or other YouTubers. And so today, I wanted to talk about how I fell in love with my hair. And while I talk about this topic, I'm going to undo these two week old twists that I did with Trelux hair care products. And luckily, in this video, I'm partnering with Trelux Hair Care, so you'll hear more about it. Stay tuned so you can get a discount code. So in a previous Trelux video, I showed putting twists in, these twists in, and then I kind of just did the twist out, and I was asked to show how I styled it after two weeks of wearing it um, without like getting a bunch of knots and tangles. So I'm gonna show you guys in this video. I did style my hair with the Trelux Reflux Curl Styling Serum, love this as a base for twist outs and braid outs because it has some form of humectants it's supremely moisturizing and it still needs a bit more of a creamy thing on top to give my hair the molding and so i pair it with the four in one hydrating cream and together it gives me just the ultimate set of twists or one that i can wear for two weeks and then when i get ready to do the twist out my hair is still moisturized which i absolutely adore so the one key thing after wearing your hair in twist for two weeks, you don't want to just go in and like start separating from the root. You really want to take your time because in two weeks time, um, hair has had time to like wrap around the strands that you have twisted, kind of like if it would lock, right? And so you don't want to just go in and kind of haphazardly separate. You want to be very, very intentional about doing it slowly and unraveling otherwise you're going to cause a knot so i just have to be patient when i leave my hair and twist that long so it definitely takes longer to style a twist out but i'm just undoing the twists right now and then i'll go back in and fluff so i want to talk about like how i fell in love with my hair and what i do when i'm like tired of doing my hair like what i fall back on so first and foremost, I think you have to keep it simple. It's really easy when you're new natural and just in general to get really bogged down in like techniques, numerous techniques, numerous trends, trying every product under the sun, trying everything under the sun, where that is going to over time cause you to get tired, right? Cause you to think that natural hair requires 50, 11 steps. When it doesn't, you have to just really focus on keeping things simple. There's nothing wrong with experimenting, but to fall in love with the process of doing hair, I'd say put more energy into styling and like making sure that your hair looks the way you want it to look between washing and keep the washing process simple. For me, that really helps, especially when I'm really busy. Um, I can just wash my hair and then throw it in a bun. It takes no more than an hour, right? That makes it so that I don't get sick of my hair. And when I wanna do something more intricate, it takes more time, like a set of twists. It's something that I, I can put energy into because I, for the most part, kept things simple. So I think really an important part of loving your hair is keeping things simple and then next is finding a style that you fall in love with so on my instagram i did these twists and i showed the twist out the last time i did the twist out and i asked the question what style when you achieved it made you fall in love with your hair and for me that was the twist out and so when i want a break when i don't like my hair in the moment I turn back to twists and twist outs because I know that's really what made me love my hair and my texture. And so I did a video saying, I'm sick of my hair at the moment, so I'm gonna put it in twists. And that's what I did. And I've worn my hair in twists since then, done a twist out a couple days, and I'm back. Like after this, I'll, I'll be going back to my regular wash routine and just having fun with my hair. Like Afro season is on the horizon, guys. And so, but I think it's really important to find that style, right? That style that made you wanna go natural. That style that really 
made you realize, hey, I can do this. I really like my natural hair in this state. And whenever you're feeling less than in love with your hair, return to it. And over time, you'll remember why natural hair is the choice for you. And one thing that's really key to making sure your hair remains manageable is to never let your hair dry out, right? So even though I wore my hair in twists for two weeks, I did not moisturize it. I use the Untie the Knot Nourishing Leave-In Conditioner. Um, halfway through the style, I just wet my hair and then I applied this, which I will also apply this again today. I'll show you what I do. Um, but the key to having less tangled hair, to having less knots, to just having more manageable hair is never letting it dry out, no matter what. <laughs> Whether it's in a protective style, no matter what, do not let your hair dry out. That is one of the biggest mistakes I see. And if you have a dry texture, it's really important to not let your hair dry out. The result of dry hair is what makes people frustrated, right? The tangles, the knots, long detangling sessions, that comes from letting your hair dry out. So just make it a practice to never ever let your hair dry out and you'll have more love for your hair because it's easier to handle. And then speaking of detangling, you have got to figure out how to get your detangling sessions to less than 30 minutes. I used to have 10 minute detangling sessions. Um, then they moved up to 15. The longer my hair gets, they get a little longer, but 30 minutes is pretty much the cutoff. And yes, it is possible. It requires healthy hair. So you need to develop a routine that focuses on healthy hair, that focuses on not letting the hair dry out. Like great product is a good way to go with this. And when prioritizing moisture in your routine, don't forget the cleansing step. I find most people forget that your cleanser can be clutch in preventing tangles if it's moisturizing. I adore the Trelux Curl Renew and Restore Gentle Cleansing Rinse because it really fits that bill. When you do that, wash day is no longer something you dread. I think a lot of the times people dread their hair because the detangling process is so arduous. And I do have a video sharing my tips for getting your detangling session short. I'll leave that video linked below. But I think that should be a major focus for you if you aren't there. I find that learning to style your hair when it doesn't turn out the way you thought it would is like the key to finding flexibility with your hair. Back in my early days, my twist outs didn't always turn out the way I wanted them to. And that's when I learned how to do different buns, right? And I had fun with updos. And now when I have an event, it's not something that I turn to because I failed at a style. It's because that's my choice, right? I have that flexibility. And so when a style fails, learn to style it so that you find beauty in your hair, even when it doesn't turn out the way you want it to, when it doesn't turn out the way you expected. That's really the advanced level of love for your hair right there, right? When your hair doesn't do what you thought it would do, but you still find a way to start so that you feel confident in it, that's when you know you love your hair. That's, that's, that's that moment. Before I move on to the last tip and we finish styling, I want to share a discount with you. You can get a discount right now on Trelux Hair Care on the Discover Trelux website. So make sure you head on over and use the code listed on the screen as well as in the description box to get these products. So like I said, to do this twist out, I use the Reflex Curl Styling Serum and the Formone Hydrating Cream. And in a moment, I'll show you how I'm using the Untie the Knot Leave-In Conditioner, but I also used it to moisturize my hair. And that's why it still looks like shiny and soft uh, and it's supple. So run, don't walk over to discovertraylux.com and get you some of these products. Okay, so before I separate these, I'm actually gonna add a bit of this moisturizer and this will help it fluff up so that it's not flat. I don't want it to be flat. I have very fine strands so it could easily like not fluff up for me <laughs> and I don't want that. So adding this moisturizer will not only like add a bit of um, moisture to the hair so the style lasts and without frizz, 
but it will help me like fluff up the hair faster, but it's not like straight water. It has a fantastic mix of water, moisturizing ingredients, you know, emulsifiers and things to help the hair remain moisturized for longer periods of time. It's the 360 complex that works. So it's not gonna destroy the definition. Like it's all still there. You can see it. It's quite nice. Uh, but it's gonna allow me to go in and separate. And like, I could actually just wear it like this if I wanted. It'd be real cute um, if I just wore it like this. But I live for big hair, but look at this definition. Can you see it? On point, and this is two weeks later, guys. Two weeks, and it's shiny. You see that? That's because I use products that gave me moisture for weeks. And I hydrated, I moisturized again midweek, but yeah. Okay, so now that we've peeped the definition, it's really simple from here. You just do what you typically would. My hair is moisturized, so it will separate. I just pull it taut so that I could see where it will separate. And then I just go in and just let it separate. I might cause some frizz from time to time, but frizz adds volume, so I am at. <laughs> And then my last tip to falling in love with your hair applies to both women and children, I think, and that is representation. You have to surround yourself with people who have texture like you so that you can really appreciate what it can do. I'm not saying that you can't follow anyone else that doesn't have your texture, but make sure you're seeing people on a daily basis that have your texture so that you covet your texture, right? You love how it looks on different people through everyday life. You're not subconsciously telling yourself that someone else's texture is more desirable by only featuring that texture in your life. It's something we do subconsciously a lot of the times. We we just favorite what looks good to us, right? But on the journey to loving your hair, it is really important to surround yourself with images of hair that looks like yours so that you can fight the daily messages that the world tells us very subtly about our hair, about what hair is, you know, socially desirable. The best way to fight that is to, on a daily basis, make sure you're seeing curly and coily textures that you admire. And you really want to admire the full spectrum. You really want to mostly feature your texture until you get to a point where, where you look at a black woman's hair and you don't criticize the level of frizz, you don't criticize, you know, the result. And instead you just love the look because it is natural hair. Uh, until you get there, I would say feature your own texture more than anything else, you know, by using Instagram, TikTok, Pinterest, etc. But after that, you know, feature the, the spectrum of curly, coily hair in your life more than anything else because society is going to give you that every day on its own. So as you can see, to finish this style, I just am doing a little picking. Um, I wasn't going for frizz free, as you could tell. I was going for volume, and I'm quite, quite happy with it. Still has plenty of definition, but it also has the volume that I love and adore in my texture. So make sure you check out Trelux Hair Care so that you can get moisturized, defined, happy hair <laughs> on a daily basis. And if there are any Trelux Hair Care products you love, make sure you leave them in the comments below so other people know what to purchase. And if you have another tip, also leave that in the comments. Otherwise, make sure you like and subscribe before you go so we can see each other in the next one. Bye. I'm not gonna stop playing with it. There's just no way. It's, it's giving me life. This is, I'm bad, I'm bad. I've worn my hair and like twists to twist out for over a month, but this makes me want to wear my hair. It's coming. So stay tuned because be care is what this next season is all about. Yes!